Hi, I'm Pamela Crawford for La Chusa, and in the next few minutes, I'm going to talk to you about one of the planters that's pretty new for La Chusa called Bacino. You can see one right here. The thing I like best about the, the Bacino planter is the size. It's about 12 inches by 12 inches, easy enough to use in many, many different places. I'm getting ready to have a party week after next. I'm finding I can use them on railings, on posts, on steps, on tables. I can't seem to plant them fast enough for the numbers of locations where I need them. Another great benefit for those of you who are busy is the fact that it is self-watering. There's a reservoir inside of this cottage pattern that includes half a gallon of water. Plan on watering about one half to one third as much as you would regular containers. Another thing I like is the proportion of this container. Um, it's almost like a bowl, but it has a very a, a sculptural characteristic to it that I like. So let's take a look at some of the plantings that I've used in these containers and see if we can give you some ideas. Now, if you want lots of color, choose red, orange, and purple. This planter features red salvia, orange zinnias, and purple petunias. Leaf color is a great look for planters. Look how nice this purple Persian shield looks with yellow marigolds and pink vinca. If pastels are more up your alley, plant blue salvia with pink zinnias and white begonias. White caladiums paired with pink begonias and creeping jenny are a great choice for color and shade. Planting a bacino planter is fun and easy, something you can do in an hour on a Saturday afternoon, or if you love flowers like me, Cover every place you've got with them. Thank you very much.